Why am I procrastinating so much? Why am I allowing myself to be distracted by every goddamn thing? Oh wait, the light. I've just been sitting on my butt doing nothing except for random ass piddly stuff that doesn't even matter. My cats are sitting there on my unmade bed, judging me harshly. And with every passing day, I become more and more unsure of when's the right time to poop. Hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. The earth churned and the house is what came out gruesome little cluster of verandas and spires, gables and windows. Clark Gable? The earth kept rising like a tick, filling with blood, drank from the earth all around it, and in that way laid claim, all to feed the house. Up atop that hill, like a queen on a throne, surveying. Bed oh, it's gonna keep going, okay. Bedrooms and drawing rooms, and halls and attics, kitchens and bathrooms and nurseries, all dark and quiet. Only some of those windows l let any light in. But there are what? But, but there was only one basement, and it was where she lived. The matriarch, screeching rat cluster of veins, connective tissue and grinning gnashing mouths it was her house god dang what are you gonna stop okay so anyway forgive the strange beginning and whoa the, you, there should be more here right okay um sure anyway what's up rascals uh forgive the strange beginning of this video. Uh, this is Lethargy Hill, the fourth and final game in the uh, Haunted Cities Volume 4 collection by H Kitty Horror Show. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure you guys are tired of these, but like I said, this is the last one until Volume 5 comes out. And I don't even know if I should have been reading that. I just got tired of it because it just will not stop droning on and it, she needed a husband yeah yeah house house need husband now how person in house need husband maybe the house grew out of the ground like a like a pestering pestering festering pussy sore i don't know i'm just reading into it because i'm not reading it what it makes sense shut up am i supposed am i supposed to do anything or just let it ramble. Uh-huh. Fancy. All right, am, I'm just gonna keep going. It's just gonna, you know what? You wanna read that? Go right ahead and read that. I'm just gonna figure out where I'm supposed to go, if I'm supposed to go anywhere. But, um, uh, yeah, uh, something's going on here, I'm sure. The, 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 the the 1992 MIDI uh, music is pretty nice, but uh, ooh, a windmill, and I can't look up or down. Can I? No. Click clacking his twiggy hands against the walls and doors, and w the wicker man. Oh, her husband. Her husband was the wicker man. Okay. Where am I going? Can I run? Yeah, I can run. Can I jump? No, I can't jump. I can't see when there's so much word in my way either. Stop it. Oh, hello. A break in the... No. It's a corner to turn. Always plans my arms hurt. What? Oh. This is starting to remind me of, um... Oh, what's its fuck? Anatomy. Yeah, that's that's what it's reminding me of. Very much so, in fact. Uh, it's getting worse. I'm... 
Not sure if I should have been reading that. Probably should have. Don't care. I'm just gonna continue exploring around this weird hedge. Trying to get up to that hill. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. That's what it was mentioned in the beginning. I don't know. Corpses sucking the ghosts out through their necks. Ooh. Kinky. Okay. Um, well, fiddledy D. I want in there. Let me in. So now she had a husband to keep her company and a sister to keep her angry. Well, isn't that what siblings are for? Um, all right. So am I going to be able to be let in or am I just going to try and escape? I'm just going to, I'm just going to go this way because how, what the hell am I supposed to do? It's not going to let me. Uh, my blood feels dull in something. I don't know, I have a... It, it was hard to read. And yet, yeah, love each other either would be nice if they'd bring life and motion and sound. Filling up the walls, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so now she wants to poop out a kid. Great. Yeah, you have yourself a little crotch goblin with a husband that creeps you out and a and a sister that you hate. I okay. I thought I fell off the edge of the world, but uh, I'm not that lucky. I'm still inundated with this freaking essay in front of my face while I'm trying to figure out where I'm supposed to go or what I'm supposed to do. You know what? This entire series of games have been nothing but just wandering aimlessly, wondering if there was an end or a reason. Uh, why did it take so long to poop him out? Her daughter would be more complicated, she told herself. Daughters are bizarre. But one thing is uh, definitely like clicking in my head and it's, it's maybe I'm just reading too much into it. My veins miss the old poison. Well, why, why did you switch to the new poison? Wait, is it like Coke and Coca-Cola? Um. Uh, you know what, people have been telling me for years that Coca-Cola is bad for you and you shouldn't drink it so much, but you know what, screw you, I like the taste. And I'm gonna keep drinking it until the day I die, and apparently that's gonna be what kills me, so... There are worse ways to go. Alright, where am I going? Plenty of legs and mandibles and eyes sticking out all over. Okay... Interesting... You know what? You know, I'm not even going to judge because you love your daughter, no matter what she looks like, and that's progressive. So, you know what? Good for you for st for not being judgmental, right? I only read one sentence in that whole thing, so if I didn't get the message right, well, let me know. I don't know. I used to burn once upon a time. Oh, things are getting worse and nasty, but at least I can see a little bit better. Okay, so I'm starting to think that I, the, the whole thing was just to read this story and... Re Why is this a game then? Why didn't she just write a blog post? Make a poem. I mean, she made a poem, but she... She put it in this... The guise of a game and... You know, I, I'm not entirely for that. I mean, anatomy was pretty cool. I liked the way it went through the system and the story and all that. But this, this is definitely not anatomy and I am not entirely feeling it. Um, because I'm just wandering around in circles. Glass knives, shears, and knives, and to use as ha she wanted to be. She's she's become Edward Scissorhands. What? Scratching the paint, marking up the wood. Hateful woman, she thought. You're supposed to envy, not assert yourself. The daughter loved this. What? Okay. 
The daughter loved the sister, and they had so much in common. After all, they were both made of dead things. They were both locked out. This made her angry. You're supposed to make my daughter hate me, she thought, but instead you've made her love you. And that's a whole different story. They weren't everywhere together. The daughter with her hundreds of slowly gar grasping sprite legs. The sister with her ghostly sockets and always sweeping pale fluid. I'll make you pay for this, sister mine. Um. Should have proofread that first. She took her solace in her son, the only one that truly loved her, that did anything right. But he was fast congealing, and each inch of carpet he dragged himself across or wallpaper he tripped and fell into took a little bit of him away. And she didn't want to lose him like that, so she made him come back to the basement. He tripped and fell down the stairs, splattered apart, and ended up just like he'd started. A pool of her blood. I'll miss you, she thought. Rattling chains, only my own house to haunt. As the drones did what? I actually wanted to read that part, because that's apparently all this game is good for. I don't even know why I'm calling it a game anymore. It's it's literally just, read this, bitch. You have no choice. She hated her family. They weren't what she wanted. The drones went to the husband, cornered him in a hallway, pulled out his hair. He fell apart, and they gathered up all the twigs and fallen branches and fed them to one of the living room's fireplaces. The sister drones lure... The sister... The drones lured into the woods with a pile of heirloom jewelry and old unsent letters. When she fell upon the pile of to feast, they fell upon her, crushing her soft pale skull and shredding her apart. All the ghosts that made her sank back down into the soil. No bodies to hold them anymore. They were free. I've done a good thing, she thought. This is definitely a weird story, and, uh, does it ever stop? Her do- Do you mind? I'm actually getting into this. Oh! Well. That's- that's wow. Um, okay. Change of scenery. Just gets a little bit worse every time. Congrats. Uh, the daughter was a sad, useless little nothing now that her sister was dead. Were they ever really alive? Who knows? Um, I don't know. Right, spiders, ungrateful. She was alone again. Is Siren Head coming to attack me? You know, I'd actually accept that at this point. Uh,. Speaking of which... Okay. Is this a... I can't decide. I don't know what to do. Oh, really? Okay. I hope someone visits me soon. Bleeding time. As uh, okay. Oh, that's getting louder. Am I getting closer to something, or is it just getting louder to be a dick? I really can't tell. Uh, someone. I don't know. I didn't make. And uh, uh, yeah. Uh huh. Right. Next paragraph, please. Thank you. I won't be alone anymore. Ooh, a sign! I can read signs! Please don't go. But where else am I going to go? I won't be alone anymore. Come and see me. I've chewed off all their skin. I won't be alone anymore. It'll be so nice not to be alone. I won't be alone anymore. I hope someone visits me soon. Well, you know what? 
if you're talking about me, um, how about you don't block off the entrance to whatever the heck that is? Ooh, something's getting soft and chewy. I think it's me. Um, what? Right. You know, most of those little cuts, the, 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 the sudden stops in everything going on, I couldn't read most of that. The blood was too splattery. It was illegible, but it was interesting. Maybe I'll reread the story when I go to edit this up, but I don't know. But anyway, that was Lethargy Hill. What do you think? Did it count as a game? I don't know. In fact, most of the Kitty Horror Show games leave me confused and questioning it for days after I've played it. And then, like, in a couple days, I'll come up with a theory on whether it's or what the story's about. And I, I, I don't know how to, like peek into the brain case of the kitty horror show and and rummage around in there and figure out what the hell all this jumbled mess means i don't know but anyway rascals thank you so much for putting up with my bullshit and uh watching this video if you're the, coming this far into it uh do me a favor watch this video watch other videos that i've done like share with your friends and all that smooth jazz that'll get me uh, jumping and jiving and and whatever other reference I plan to make for some weird reason. And I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, little man. Sweet, delicious, inevitable death.